Okay. I went through weather and wind with this. I don't know if that's a saying in English, but it means that I went through a lot with this. I went to Ikea, I bought a cabinet and I'm gonna build it right now. And I thought, what better way to build a cabinet than to make a video about it and talk about my life. Okay, so my apartment is a mess right now because I have a lot going on, but I'm gonna try to make some room for this cabinet. I think I'll push away my old coffee table and I'll do everything there. Okay, let me... So this is a glass cabinet. I went in the rain on a metro on the bus. I'm... okay. Let's go. I have very little experience in building IKEA furniture, so this will go, uh, yeah, this will be interesting. Okay, so I'm reading a manual first, or like looking at it, and I'm already confused, like why, why would I put screws or whatever it's called in English at the bottom of the, the cabinet? Oh, the screws are to change the height of the, the, if your floor is not even or something. Okay. Oh, you have to drill the back of your camera to the wall. Anyways, let's try this out without. I think I've said it in a few videos before, um, or on my live streams, I'm not sure. But I uh, started studying again. I went to college at 16 and then I dropped out of college. Then I tried another, um, course but it still wasn't for me and I kind of wanted to make my own business and whatnot and spend more time for YouTube so I dropped out again and now is my final try at studying and I'm studying East Asian languages and cultures with a major in Chinese and I'll do a minor in diversity and globalization and for now I'm really enjoying it I think it's really the right one the right study the right course for me even though it is very intense and kind of hard we have to learn a lot every day so that is also why I haven't been able to upload for a while now um, because I've, I've been very busy with school okay that's better so when it comes to the content I'm um, I will upload in the future. I definitely will continue YouTube. I'm really enjoying the marathon reactions lately because I can react to a bunch more in one video and it makes it easier for me to give you guys a lot of content while not having to film very much or, I mean, it's a long, longer time obviously, but I don't have to film a lot of separate videos. It's just one big video. And I also can live stream it, which is like kind of two in one. So that's why I'm really enjoying that. And also because I'm sure I don't miss any major videos. I just, I love when I get to know a new group. I love watching a lot of videos. So it's hard for me to react to a bunch of different small videos and then have to wait for, you know, to react to another one. So that's what I also really like about it. And also, I started YouTube not with the plans of reacting to K-pop, but it was the K-pop reactions that kind of stood out and that made me grow. I made the, my first K-pop reaction because I wanted to react to K-pop because I was enjoying K-pop. I wanted to discover more groups and especially because I didn't have any friends who like K-pop in real life. So I kind of wanted to build an online community and to share my, my kind of enthusiasm and passion for K-pop with the world and not only with K-pop but with like the whole Asian cultures that's also why I'm majoring in East Asian cultures right now because it's it's really something that really grew my interest and so if you might have already noticed that I posted like a few recipes and like a K-pop dance video where I tried out like a lot of K-pop dances and a vlog so I kind of want to make some more original content other than just K-pop reactions and that is also why I think it's a good idea to make these marathons so I won't have like hundreds of K-pop reactions and then only a few other videos but at least the videos I do have which are K-pop reactions which I think probably will still be like 80% of my content but at least those videos are much longer and you guys get a lot more out of it 
and my other videos I'm planning to make are definitely still related to Asian culture uh, and Asian pop culture, Asian probably traditional culture as well. I also plan, since I have to study so much, I also plan on making videos where I study Chinese, study Korean because that will be in my minor as well. Um, and make maybe make ASMR study with me videos where I just um, study my characters and you guys can study along or enjoy it as ASMR, I don't know. I think that might be a fun idea and it might be good for myself to one, motivate myself to study, to share it with you all and maybe motivate you guys to study. And also, um, but if you have any, if you like the, the ideas I'm talking about right now or you have any other ideas you would enjoy, um, please let me know in the comments down below because I don't want to go totally off rail. You know, I still want to make content that you guys enjoy as well as content that I enjoy and that works with my daily life. Yeah, anyway, I should. I also still will go to Korea in the hopefully near future. Ooh. Um, as if you follow me for. I know. Okay, wait a second because I can't talk while, while trying to do this. If you've been following me for a while now, you will know that I participated in a video contest and I won a trip to Korea and back. So I'm still going there. I mean, hopefully, if they still have their money. Normally, if everything goes well, I will go. I will still go to Korea soon, and obviously, I will document that as well, make some vlogs. And if you guys want me to check things out while I'm there, or you know, do certain activities. I will definitely try to do them. Um, I would. It would be so fun to be able to go to like an award show or something, um, or like a music bank thing. I'm not sure how to find that or how to go to that, but a lot of um, my subscribers back in the day when I was talking about going to Korea said that it's actually not that expensive and there's a lot of those kind of shows in Korea, so you know. I would like to do that as well. I also have some art projects going on um, that have to do with Korean culture and Asian culture. So I'm also planning on um, releasing some videos about that. And I'm, I'm thinking about opening a PO box because, not because I want presents, but I kind of want to exchange art and exchange maybe letters with you guys because I, I think that would be really cool as well as like trying out different snacks from all over the world would be kind of cool um, but I'm, I don't think I'm at the point right now on my YouTube channel with my subscribers where I'm able to do that because I don't think the people who follow me are that passionate about my channel that they would go out their way to send me something that, that's kind of weird to me to think about so yeah, let me know what you think about that in the comments um, and I'll see. Also my lighting is probably very bad because it's very sad weather outside and my big lamp is kind of in the back because I also don't want it to shine too much on me. Oh my god. So yeah, that's, that's what's going on with the lighting. I think it's this one. Oh no, wait, where is it? Where is the other one? Oh, here. Oh, it might be this one, actually. I think it's this one. Huh? I think it's like this. What the hell does this mean? Oh, wait a second. I'm stupid. I'm so stupid. Okay. I've got it. I should listen to a podcast while doing this. So, can we put this? Okay, okay. Are you guys seeing this? I'm I'm a genius. I am a genius and I definitely didn't struggle at all. I think when it comes to who I'll react to in the future, of course I'll still react to um, the ones I'm reacting to right now because, you know, especially NCT, I really enjoy, I really love them. I might even say they are my old. I don't know, I can't really choose between NCT and BTS. Um, oh shit. What? I'll definitely continue reacting to NCT. I have a bunch of NCT videos I still want to react to that are still in my list. But I think my reaction that is next up first, or first next up, I'm not sure, is gonna be ESPA. 
because you guys recommended that a lot and I've seen Savage going like around everywhere so I think it's pretty good. Um, even though I'm not really into girl groups most of the time, I still want to check them out obviously, I still want to give them a chance because maybe they're different so um, yeah, so you can expect them or maybe it's already up before I upload this video, I'm not sure, it might be. There are a lot of groups I still want to check out, I think one of the first next up also will be ATs and Stray Kids I also still want to check out. Yeah, and a bunch of other groups actually, like a lot of groups I still want to check out. Pentagon is also pretty high on my list. So yeah, you can expect a lot of reactions still. Um, you might know that mentally I kind of struggle or I've been struggling the past year as well. You know, it's, it's going kind of better even though with winter coming up it's kind of going like a little more rocky again but um it is definitely better than it was like half a year ago because it was kind of really bad then but yeah so that's kind of positive i guess we are nearing the end at first i was kind of struggling but now it's 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 kind of simple now i don't think i have much else to say um, other oh yeah patreon i haven't been reacting on videos on patreon for a very long time which i do feel very bad about um and i really want to react to more but the problem is with patreon i mostly react to shows tv shows which are longer um and oh okay but yeah of course i'm still um planning on continuing on page patreon I've been talking about having a schedule for a while now because I never had a schedule. I never um, had a schedule saying I would post every week or I would post on certain days or I would post certain shows on certain days. So I never really promised that I would upload regularly or weekly or, you know, but it is kind of a plan because, you know, I still have to make it worth it for what you guys are donating and right now I'm definitely not giving a lot of value in return. Because of that, also, if you want your money back for months that I haven't been uploading or have been uploading very poorly, you can request, um, send me a message and request me a refund, and I will give you a refund. Um, because I do feel, you know, really bad about the situation. Okay, guys, are you seeing this? Okay! Oh, my, oh my, wait, I hope I still get the, the glass in here. Oh, I'm proud of myself. Oh shit. Oh, shit. I think I should have done that before. Oh wait, I can do it like this. Oh, thank God. Guys. I did it. I'm proud of my work. I also bought these um, lamps to put into that you can like stick. Oh, shit. How am I gonna do that? Yo, is there no way I'm gonna get this in there? I'm already cutting open my my new. Yeah, that's not gonna work. I'm gonna try to put lamps in there and then I'm gonna fill it up and then I'll show you the end result. But I firstly wanna say goodbye um, and I also hope you guys are doing well. Um, I hope you guys are safe, healthy, everything. And I hope you're looking forward to more videos of me again, hopefully soon. I just want you to know that I'm definitely not stopping with uploading on YouTube. I'm definitely continuing. I'm definitely looking forward to it and I'm working on it. Um, so you can definitely, I'm saying a lot of definitely, you can definitely expect a lot of um, new videos in the future. And also a giveaway, which I've, I've been telling you for a while that I'm going to do on my Instagram, but it's coming very soon, probably this week or next week at last. So yeah, hopefully you look forward to that and thank you so much for watching. Yeah, hopefully until my next video. Bye.